Hi, this is Vignesh with a cool epsilon command. Uh, before going to do this cool session, I would like to thank Mr. Kamalesh who supports me and who helps me to build this kind of stuff. And uh, another person is Mr. Kubakaran, who is my best friend and also my best well wisher. Uh, so I want to thank these two people. I don't want to make bore with you people. So um, just start this cool session. Opening Epsilon, you can see in the taskbar it shows Epsilon 13.12 and Yield version 13.12. Cool, isn't it? It's, it? This is the latest version we are using and uh, this is the latest version also we, the, the main object of the Luguru.com we are released to this. Here you can see the final folder uh, who's, which is over, uh, over the Mr. Bob. He's Mr. Bob. You can see here, he's Mr. Bob and just tagging this folder into Epsilon. You can see uh, five files. This is e file. This is the command file, main source of the file. And here we have a Mac file. Macro. This is the supporting file. These two patterns dot Mac pattern dot txt are supporting files. And sample dot xml, sample dot test dot xml. These are the uh, files we gonna see a uh, sample files. Okay. Uh, first, I would like to open this file to show what is. Uh, how to uh, we gonna link here? Okay, just check we have any of the bibliography references. Here we have the patterns name with the year and the name with year. Here we have the name with the year. Also, here also we have and here also we have. Cool, isn't it? Let's check down. We have any of these kind of stuff here around. I believe I'm not seeing anything. Let's check after running the command, which if somewhere we are hidden, it will show automatically. Let's check it out. Okay, this is the uh, main main folder, which have few of the commands and few of the bibliography links. Yes, so I choose this one. I'm not choosing for those kind of stuff. So I just uh, choose a random one. So I took this one. Okay, this stuff then. Test1.xml, which consists of all the back matter, uh, which, which means the bibliography references, which coded with the relevant and attributed sections here. Okay, let's wind up this session very soon. So, uh, to build this one, to I'm um, so I'm gonna use this pattern dot mac to uh, for a uh, for my supporting purposes. I'm first loading this file. Load file. Okay, PACT pattern dot Mac loaded zero error detected once you uh, once you have exported the macro I believe you you are aware of how to load a macro so I don't want to make your uh, session board so uh, just open this chapter XML split the window and go to the pattern dot XML okay. To bring the chapter XML with a unique pattern, so I'm running this pattern dot XML. Okay, uh, don't get confused or don't get uh, sorry. Uh, what to say? Uh, these people are hiding something uh, likewise. I'm just making the uh, chapter with a unique format, so I'm running this kind of stuffs. Okay, uh, compiling this macro, which is running cool. Okay, we've done it, so we don't want the edit text files. And closing it here, we have the finally we have the uh, XML, and we would like to load the uh, main object of this command file. This is the command biblink and named as biblink dot e open. Oh my God! Where is the command? Where is the program? Uh, let's see in the down. Yeah, here comes the error file. Include e dot h command. B1 for some confidential confidential purposes. Uh, I'm not showing my yield program and yield commands and those kind of stuffs. So uh, leave that. Just compile this one. Alt F3. You can see in the taskbar compiled and loaded. Just close this window. We don't want that until uh, we closing this uh, epsilon. If you're once you close the epsilon, you don't able to run the uh, commands where you where you have uh, loaded. So, uh, we are aware of it. I'm opening the bibliography 
session. Just go to the top of the uh, chapter uh, main text, press F2 and name. Uh, I said uh, we have named it to B1. So I'm pressing B1 and giving enter. I believe all the changes were made and we have already uh, loaded. Just find B. Mm. Wow, cool, cool, working cool. Let's check whether it's linked with the correct one. Vault 2007. We have the vault here. Any? Yeah, we have the author here. And the name here of 2008. Actually, sorry. Here, date 2007. Okay, let's check name group. The name group, author. It's here. Waller and year. Okay, let's check another beef reference with linking 1944 okay let's check here I'm just copying this and finding here we are linking here and the year of 1947 okay let's check another linking also here Araf also here check Araf cool isn't it working find yeah, RF and 2013. I believe my session made you fine and uh, have completed my task very successfully. Thanks for watching this video. For more Epsilon tricks and for more Epsilon related uh, stuffs, just go to this luguru.com. He is the owner of Epsilon and uh, up to 13.12. Uh, these people were uh, started this Epsilon and still they have developed for more queries and for uh, more uh, epsilon related queries you can ask there or you can ask here in my mail account just go to your mailbox and to send all your queries and doubts to epsilon a d i q r at gmail dot com Sorry, I've coded at where is it? At not at what happened to at 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 sorry it is at so please name it as at okay then what else then go to Facebook if you want to uh, communicate with us in the in, in, in the Facebook just type Facebook yeah flash it this is our Facebook page. Just go here. My network is a little bit slow, so please apologize. I apologize for that. And see here, this is our page. Just go here and like our page. Like our page to know more stuff here. Yeah, this is asking me to log in. So I, I unfortunately uh, signed out here, so it is going like that. Um, you can get more stuff here. You can see uh, invisibly some reference stage TOC and reference taking also here. This kind of stuff you can get it here, and you, you can also uh, get all the doubts, clarify all your doubts, and all your uh, requirements related to epsilon. Thanks for watching this video. Have a nice day.